33 million people in seven states are sweltering under some of the hottest temperatures ever recorded. Scientists are calling it an event that happens only once in a thousand years. Intense, prolonged, unprecedented, dangerous. That's how the National Weather Service is describing the historic heat wave hitting the Pacific Northwest, pushing daytime temperatures into the triple digits. On Sunday, Portland hit 112 degrees, with Seattle topping out at 104 degrees. Today, they're expected to go even higher. To have such hot temperatures in June is historical. We haven't had anything like that. Experts say the northwestern United States is under what they call a once-in-a-millennium heat dome that has ground many normal activities to a halt. I can't move around outdoors. In the Pacific Northwest, where air conditioners are only needed a handful of days a year, residents were lining up to buy them, but this store sold out. I apologize. We were supposed to get more in. On top of that, the power demand has caused outages for some 3,000 customers in Portland and 3,400 in Seattle. It's feared the early heat wave could mean an early kickoff to the West wildfire season as officials already begin to restrict 4th of July fireworks. It's just a matter of, you know, what's going to set it off. And now you got the 4th of July coming. We're, we're hearing uh, fireworks go off every night. We're now right back into it and having to be prepared for uh, an eventual brush fire that's going to happen that's going to call us all out to the field. Again. California is already suffering under drought. These satellite images taken about one year apart of the Angeles National Forest in Southern California illustrate the drought that is gripping the state. Major reservoirs are down in the west, threatening agriculture and drinking water supplies. Folsom Lake, serving 40 million Californians, is down 78 feet. Lake Mead, which serves 25 million people, including Las Vegas, is down 156 feet. And for those Americans in the Midwest and East, forecasters warn the heat is headed your way this week, with cities from Richmond to New York hitting the mid-90s. And in some places, it could feel like the triple digits. Dale Hurd, CBN News.